Hey guys, Dr. Brown here, and tonight we're talking about first grade subtraction. Hey, let's get after it. You know, in a previous video, we looked at um, addition, and we said, well, let's just use our fingers. Now, this is when you're first starting to learn. We learn to count, right? One, two, three. And we said, well, if we have one, two, three, that we're adding one. So one plus one is two. Two plus one is three. Three plus one is four. So when we count, we would be saying one, two, three, four. If we count up by one, we're adding one each time. So we've been adding all along. If we can learn to count backwards, five, four, three, two, one. If we can practice counting backwards, that's subtraction by one. Whoa. See, you already know how to subtract. All right, let's practice this. If we have, if we count backwards, five, four, three, two, one. What about Mr. Zero? Whoa, let's practice that one. Five minus one. If we count down, five, four, three, five minus one is four. Now, we can do this in different ways. Remember in our other video, we used our fingers. We said, let's let five, two, three, four, five. That's five fingers. I guess four fingers and a thumb, okay? But if we were to put, we're subtracting one. So five minus one. Well, we can see this one cancels out that one. So we end up with one, two, three, four. Okay, four minus one. So now we have four minus one. Well, this one cancels that one. So I have one, two, three. Whoa, three minus one. So now I have three, one, two, three, minus one. So this one and this one cancel, and I end up with one, two. Three minus one is two. Now, two minus one, this one and that one cancel. Two minus one is one. One minus one, uh oh This one cancels that one. One minus one is What's left? Ah, zero. Okay, so practice counting backwards and that will help you. You can also use your fingers in different ways. Let's see. If I have three, let's see, let me do five. Five, can you see that? Five minus two. Five minus two. Now we can draw the fingers. So let's do that first. Five. One, two, three, four, five. Minus the two. These two cancel those two out. So end up with one, two, three. Sometimes the confusion comes in where we've learned to count on our fingers and then they throw the number up there. And so in the very beginning, until you get comfortable and memorize these, it's okay to change this back to fingers. Okay? Now when we get above 10, it gets a little bit more complicated and we'll have to do some other things. But for now, let's practice this. So learn to count backwards by one. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. And that means you're subtracting one each time. If you have another problem where you're subtracting more than one, 
Now you can, I do this often, let's see, 5, I'm subtracting 2, okay, 1, 2. I took 2 off, I counted the number of fingers I reduced. What did I end up with? 3. 5 minus 1. 1, 2, 3, 4. So I subtracted the 1. 5 minus 3. So 1, 2, 3, that gives me 2. So you can do it that way. You can count the reduction. So 5 minus 4. Well, 5 minus 1, 2, 3, 4. That left me just the 1. So 5 minus 4 is 1. Now we could say 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, so these cancel each other, and I'm left with just 1. Okay, so those are the variety of ways. Now this video, I should have announced this in the beginning. This is for a, a family that I met at Gongcha in Metro Mall uh, I don't know, last week, I guess, earlier, earlier in the week, I guess. The mother and father work in Sutherland, and they had uh, their children with them. And tonight, I ran into the father at uh, Cha Time at SM Mall, and he had his son with him, and his son uh, was, had mentioned that they've been looking at Kubo Math, and I failed to get the son's name. But this video, he said his grandpa was helping him. They've been watching the videos, and he's been counting on his fingers. So good job, buddy, and good job, grandpa. Way to go, grandpa. Way to take the time and uh, help your grandson. That's good stuff. So... Uh, oh, and they said the comments were turned off when it's a video made for children, though you can't, uh, the comment section are automatically turned off by YouTube, and which is a positive thing, I think. So, um, but if you need me, leave message at Gong Cha or, or Cha Time, either one, and uh, we'll help you in any way we can. So why are we doing this? Together, we're trying to build a better tomorrow. And that grandpa, the father and the son, by looking at these videos, they're helping the little guy build a better tomorrow and learn some skills, and that's good stuff. So thanks, guys, for the positive feedback, and we'll help you guys any way we can. So that said, link up with your local schools. All you listeners, the teachers need help, the schools need help. Help them with whatever supplies they need, books, notebooks, pencils, pens, erasers, big erasers, <laughs> okay. Uh, and, and then uh, lend a, just lend a hand to a child today, okay. All right, that's all for now. Let's build a better tomorrow, and uh, we'll talk to you guys next time. Remember... Practice counting down, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, okay, or start with 10, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, so that you can practice subtraction and then practice counting up, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and so on, so that you can practice addition. All right, that's all for now. Talk to you soon. Thanks.